It is an unmovable fact that I killed Harlan. Yes, you did. Yes, he did. Yes, you are. But, but, I spoke in the car about the hole at the center of this donut. And what you and Harlan did that fateful night seems at first glance to fill that hole perfectly. A donut hole in a donut's hole. But we must look a little closer. And when we do, we see the donut hole has a hole in its center. It is not a donut hole, but a smaller donut with its own hole. And our donut is not a hole at all. Look, look, I understand that this is amusing for you. Why was I hard? Why would someone harm me? Someone fishing for a crime to reverse the will, Blanc. But I was hard before the sealed will was read. So, so yes, the person must have known the contents of the will. But one step further, that same person must have known a crime was committed. And further, if the intent was to reverse Marta's inheritance, they must have known that Marta was responsible. An intriguing combination of factors. Someone who knew what Marta did, wanted to expose it, but could not reveal how they knew. Friend, she was blackmailing me. She knew what I did. Yeah, but Fran wanted money. Ugo, she did not want the crime exposed. Well, did someone in the family had observed Marta doing something suspicious? But they would have had no reason not to speak up. The answer is not so simple. Now, with the entire solution in my field of view, the arc of this case is a tragedy of errors. Amata, it will not be easy for you to hear. But there is at least one truly guilty party behind it all. Guilty in the true sense of acting with malice and committing a heinous crime with selfish intent.